Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Bravely Default. So we kind of just left off here. Let's go see... Yeah, we'll check the town out later. Let's go see what's going on at this little village we just stumbled upon. Yes, perhaps. Hmm? hmm? What is it? Oh, so here... We, I think we can find out more about Edea. Edea, your mother and father were born right here in this village. Though they were five years apart, they were quite close, you know. They lived near each other, and their families got along quite well. It was as if they were brother and sister. At age 18, your father left to enter an elite school in the city of Eternia. He was the great hope of the village, you know, and he did all in his power not to disappoint. He eventually graduated at the head of his class and made a name for himself in the city. The pride and joy of our village he was. It was 21 years ago when your father asked for your mother's hand in marriage. She, just 19, and he, but 24. So it was, they began a new life together in this city of Eternia. It was the following year that the Great Plague struck our village, wiping out most of the residents. Yes, perhaps. Hmm. Hmm? What is it? Oh, what is the Great Plague? Mm, yes, the Great Plague. Twenty years have passed since it first struck. A sickness that began in eastern lands soon spread, wreaking havoc across the world ere it reached our land. It struck the year after your parents were wed and moved to the city, you know. Once the plague took root in Gravemark Village, all roads out of the village were closed. It was on orders from the head temple of the Crystal Orthodoxy, ruler of this land at the time. But I still believe they made the right choice. After all, the city of Eternia was spared the Great Plague's devastation. Hmm. Millions upon millions across the world lost their lives in a matter of months ere the plague subsided. And I have been tending the graves ever since. Your parents paid us a visit upon the road's reopening, you know. They seem truly sorry that their hometown had to be forsaken for the good of the city. Yes, perhaps you may stay. Okay, I think that's the last thing. I think we can stay the night and I think that might be it. I, I feel like this place is probably going to serve some more importance later in the game. Is that all about we can do here? Okay. Ooh! I can inspect the gravestones for things. Okay. Is that a goat? Okay, can't do anything with the goat. Let's go ahead and give it another quick save a So last episode, we didn't actually finish... Finish exploring the road because that's what I was doing. I defeated the two creatures, but I didn't finish exploring the road here, so we just know what we're doing. Most of the town, so yeah, so we can't hear. We fought the road, we fought the western road, we didn't fight the eastern road, so I guess that works out for us. Yeah, so we can see the road in a way. We don't have to take care of it. Yeah, so it doesn't look like there's anything to fight. So I guess we'll go back to the village, we'll heal up, and then uh, we'll go straight to. The castle, I guess. Oh, he's still alive. Yeah, 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 he's still alive. Y
let's go ahead and uh, use on this to revive. Okay, and then let's use on a rabbit here. Oh, no, he's dead. No! Oh, I'm going to use this too. I'm actually resetting about that. That's okay. That's my fault. Okay, so I'm going to see if we need a in here. Let's go ahead and do a quick in. And then we can continue our lives here. It looks like we need actually on. Hey, no, we need money for money. That's not even money. I don't need money. If it's actually what we need for a while, it's too full. I spent all the money But I'm guessing I'm not going to be needing more for a little while, so. Let's go ahead and save. Let's also update on. Let's do the town. Okay, so it doesn't look like there was a crazy amount of updates, but there was a, a little bit. So we have 20 things. So let's do 10 here. And then we'll do the remaining in there. It's a lot of time still. Let's see, we could probably take a couple people off here. Wait, like an hour? Um, that's close. It's almost done. Wait, that's an hour. What else is like close to being done? Okay, so I guess this is not something I can't even hear. Well, it's really long, but it's just a couple more hours, I guess. Put a couple there, we'll let it just tell you that. Six hours? We're gonna put one guy right here. Okay, I think we're gonna do that. We can continue. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Let's go to where we're actually supposed to be here. Oh, no, 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 no,
Where did they go? Victor spoke of getting treatment. The closest place around here for that would be... the room to the right! Okay. Should we go there, though, is a real question. Okay, there's nothing in here. Let's go ahead and do a quick saber rule. Okay, should we go straight to the right? I kind of want to be... Oh, I can't even check that out over there. And then this room doesn't look like it had. Oh, guards. It looks like um, an attack zone. Like guard. Let's just have some gears going off those. I just have some attacks going here. Wait, what did I just do? Oh, I don't have this other thing going. Okay, let's just do another attack. It's not the best here, but. And then for this, we just have some gears going. I can't really do much. I'm going to these. I'll just find that. Oh, they're not even that strong at all. Oh, yeah, that's because they're not even that strong at all. Yeah, that's what I'm going to find. I'm just going to find that looking straight. Okay. They're honestly not that tough, so. I'm not going to worry too much about it. I don't think there's anything I can do in this room, though. Okay, so yeah, the only place I can go is to the right. Well, then that is where we go. Into the room, but let's also make sure we heal before we go in there. Okay. This treatment is merely a bid to save her life. Now, about that story. In truth, it is a tale of the not-too-distant past. Once upon a time, in a place not of this land, there was an orphan child suffering an incurable disease. Her name was Victoria. Abandoned by physicians and all around her, she simply waited upon her inevitable demise, all the while gasping in pain and despair. But hearing her voiceless pleas, the Lord Marshal took her in his arms and brought her back to Eternia. My father did that? Were it not for his lordship, her fragile life would have soon been snuffed out. I am sure you are well aware, Adia, but science and medicine in our land have advanced greatly with the use of white magic. I was pulled from my studies on the Earth Crystal to treat her, and yet my treatments were still experimental, incomplete. She survived, but ill effects linger, side effects graver still than her original condition. Fits like that you witness strike periodically, and their frequency increases with each day. Violent turns of mood soon stripped her of any semblance of self-control. Each time her tiny form is racked with pain, I ask myself, knowing the result, would I still have intervened as I did? But ever is my answer the same. As long as I draw breath, I will see that she does too. No matter how she suffers, I'll not allow her to die. She is both my crime and my redemption. My ego, my joy. I dedicate my entirety to her. And know no greater pleasure. <laughs> what nonsense. <gasps> I mean, really, Victor, that was so boring and really long, too. Forgive me, Victoria. How do you fare now? Back to my old self. But I don't think I could take another one of those fits. 
Now, let's take care of these fools once and for all. To think you just stand around twiddling your thumbs when you had a second chance to finish me. But that just proves you're the fools I knew you were. <laughs> All right, bro. Let's get it. Don't blame me. You're the ones who just dug their own graves. All right, bro. Let's get it. Finally, we can fight them. Let's go. We won't lose this time. Okay. Let's see. Victor and Victoria. I definitely want to kill Victoria first, I think. Just get her out of the way. So, let's just go ahead and hit her with a normal attack for now. We'll do a holy weapon on all of them. Go ahead and do... Ooh. That might be good. And then let's just go ahead and do... You know what? Let's default with Ring of Bell just for this turn. Dark. Okay. So we do around 1,000 damage with Agnes. This should, this should be pretty strong here. Okay. That's pretty good. Say goodbye. And then we do that thingy. Pretty strong. Okay. Then let's just go ahead and do a bunch of attacks on Victoria. We should probably we should probably want to get rid of her as soon as we can. Let's do some Furagas maybe. Oh, we can do it on both foes, too. Just to get Victor going, too. Let's just go ahead and do a jump on Victoria. And with Ring-A-Bell, we're gonna go ahead and do... A Curata on all allies. Yeah, so Agnes does about 2,000 per hit. Dark, okay. Perfect, that came literally just in time. Okay, so he amplified his own fire, which is all right. But I'll have to be careful. Okay, let's go ahead and compound. What can we compound here for fun? I don't even know. I, I need to buy some more of, like, this stuff. Raises P attack. Okay. What else should I do? Raises P attack. Hmm. And then maybe a P defense on Agnes? Wait, no. Oh, I just totally messed that up. Okay. Raises P attack on Agnes, and then I want to raise... Uh... M defense on Agnes. Yes, that's exactly what I want to do here. Okay, you missed on that. Ooh, good critical. Okay, there we go. So now her M defense is also higher, which is going to be nice. Let's do another jump on Victoria. And then let's do another Kirata here. Okay, elemental attacks up, which is fine. I was hoping they would actually hit. Poison? That's gross. Well, whenever his rejuvenation comes up, we'll be able to use that to get rid of the poison. Oh. That dark must be able to hit if we're poisoned with, like, an ailment or something. Okay, let's go ahead and, uh... Hit Victoria with a bunch of attacks here. Let's aim the Furagas just at Victoria. Okay, I keep forgetting that I don't do that with Tiz. I just want to be—I just want to be doing the jumps here. I'll use another Kirata here. Okay, that's okay. That's okay again. That—that that won't kill anyone. Okay, she healed up around three thousand. That's not the worst case scenario though. That 3,000 is negated by Agnes, basically, just now. So that's okay. Kirata to get everyone out of death range here. So the first one's gonna be for both, but then they're gonna start... ...specifically going for Victoria with the last three here. Okay, let's do another Kirata. Make sure we're not Fairy's Aid. All Melto attacks up. That's fine. You won't really... They're not doing a lot of attacking, so... Let's do another jump. Another Kirata. Dark. That's okay. Just don't hit him. Hmm. Your early years may be tragic indeed, but I cannot forgive 
The need to crush the orthodoxy. Total annihilation would be too easy on them. They'll all pay for what they did to me. Okay, ring a bell should be fine there. Kirata, get out of death range. Okay, another Kirata. Wait, is this? I need a special to come up so I could get rid of this poison. But it doesn't seem to want to come up. Okay, let's go ahead and brave. Hit Victoria with all we got. Special piercing bolt Victoria. Keep forgetting, that's not what I do. And then another Kirata. And we should be good. Yeah, I need Victor to not heal her. And we need to kill her quick. Cause she's the she's the only one that actually that's six thousand. Stop doing that. Okay. Yes, keep darking. That's fine. That doesn't really do that much, surprisingly. So I'm okay when that happens. But I need Victoria to not get healed. Because that sets me back farther and farther. Okay. The deal. Let's go ahead and bring out some more Furagas here. Target her as quick as... Wait, I don't have enough for that other one. Absorbs MP. Let's absorb MP. Absorb more MP, and then another Kirada. Bam. Keeps healing her, man. I need him to stop doing that. But it's a car it's alright, it, it's negated pretty easily. But still. Okay, some MP. Some more MP. Okay. Oh, we got a special up. Let's use the special on Victoria. Ooh, finally, we have. Rejuvenation? Oh, I guess I don't need that second one. We just rejuvenate and we'll be good. Okay, this, this won't do a whole lot of damage, but it'll do something. Yeah, I guess that's alright, but mostly the buff that it gives is what's good. Corpse? That's annoying. I wonder, will the rejuvenation get rid of the doom effect? It looks like it won't. It's a little annoying. Okay, well then, let's try to get rid of Victoria now, then. We're gonna do a jump. And let's do another Kirata to make sure nothing crazy happens. Yes, that's perfect. Angelic Ward. Perfect. And we could totally heal out of that. So that's not really that big of an issue. Victoria's gone. Well, we won't, so get over it. Victoria! Victoria! Well, maybe if y'all weren't genocidal freaks, maybe this wouldn't happen. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, do some of that. Get some Furagas going on Victor. Alright, Victor. Big buddy. It's your turn. Um, let's just use a normal Kirata. Eh, might not even need it, actually. Let's just use, um... Does he have any buffs on him that I can dispel? Doesn't look like it. Well, then an Aeroga it is. Holy. Okay, that doesn't do that much damage. Yeah, alright. Let's focus our attacks on him. Let's get rid of him. It's a lot of damage right there. Okay, um, let's just default. I think he's gonna die here. Yep. So, that sucks. Well, let's just go ahead and phoenix him up, and I think we should be good here. No problem. It's a little annoying that he died, but hey, it is what it is. Let's use a Kirata. Get everyone- don't- Okay, I was like, get. Oh, and ring a bell is dead. Okay. Fair enough, it default. Default. Phoenix back on ring of belts. Bring him back up. Holy. 
That's perfectly fine. Default default. Let's hit him with a jump. And we'll use a Kirata. And we should be good here. Perfect. Holy. That's perfectly fine. Won't do too much damage. Okay. Let's start unleashing what we got here. I'm gonna go ahead and unleash with her too. Piercing Bolt. And we'll use some Furagas. Oh wait, I don't have enough. I just have enough for one. What's some medication? How about we compound something fun, huh? Let's do something fun. Oh, okay. Well then, let's just do a dark... Wait, no, not dark matter. He's made of dark matter. How about water? And fire. Sounds like a good idea to me. Let's do it again. How about some fire? And... Um... Why not? Let's just do that. Um... You know what? We'll default with Ring Bell for now. We'll just let Agnes do her damage here. With her Assassin Blades. Okay, your elemental attacks are up, but it doesn't really help you that much. And it should also raise magic damage, which is nice. Makes a few Agas do just that little tiny bit more. Also, can I like make this pillow more centered? Bomb arm. I totally made that even worse. Okay, fair enough. Well, we're just gonna go ahead and brave four times with Agnes again. Tis, we're gonna go ahead and jump with. And we'll just use a Kirata just to make sure everyone's all nice and healthy here. Yeah, I'm like totally sideways on here. I'm just gonna go ahead and fix myself super quickly. Maybe a little too much. There we go. I should be good. Get back to here. What happened? Okay. Um. I don't have any mana. Huh. Okay, let's do this then. Asper. 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 Let's get some MP rolling back into the... Into this place. Um. Eroga? That should be fine. Kirata, that won't help you much, buddy. You're gonna be dead pretty soon here. Yep, and then Idea will get some MP back. Just so she can start flinging some more spells. Yoink. Mine. Okay. How about we do a high jump? Ooh. Yes. Actually, let's go ahead and... Do two high jumps, why not? High jumps look fun to me. Wait. Oh wait, four, okay, so high jump. Wait, why can't I do two? Can I not, can I not do high jump? Maybe I can only do one at a time? Okay, well, fair enough, I guess. Let's do another Aroga. Okay, doesn't really hurt that much. Is he out of MP? Can bosses run out of MP? I don't even know. Can they run out of MP? No, he didn't run out of it. Okay, I was gonna say, like, what? Okay. Let's go ahead and attack him. Not give him any time to heal himself, because that's boring. Do another high jump. Let's go ahead and default with Ring of Bell. Yeah, without Victoria, this guy is pretty useless. So this fight just got, like, immeasurably easier right here. Which is cool with me. Okay. Let's do... You know what? We'll leave that special for now. Let's just go ahead and use a Furaga. And we'll default again. High jump. Okay. Let's use another Furaga. Another high jump. And another default. Holy... Ooh, that actually... Oh, but she's not dead, though. And you're gone. I am in your debt. You grant me the you gift of death. I now go to be by Victoria's side. Indeed. <laughs> sweet Victoria. Sweet, sweet. I don't get why he's so obsessed with Victoria. It doesn't make much sense to me. Ooh, nine nine nine. Okay. 999JP, you love to see it. 
Okay, we got two asterisks now, which is cool. We get the Arcanist, which unleashes an awesome power by combining black magic. Highest M attack. Obs okay. So an Arcanist. Kind of cool. Probably not going to use it, though. Unless I make Adia that? I don't know. And then we got the Spirit Master. What does this do? Controls elemental forces. Most effective healing. Okay, is this a... Is this just a better white mage? I'll have to Google that. I might switch ring -a bell to Spirit Master. Okay, I'm gonna party chat. I think... If I... I'm gonna party chat next episode. You know, we'll party chat this episode. Screw it. I just want to do it. Let's hurry. What's wrong, Agnes? Why did you stop? Wait, Adia. Agnes needs a moment, but we're almost to the Earth Crystal. We should hurry and awaken it. Everlast Tower is just ahead once we put through the Central Command. Adia, my heart aches. I know what this must be like for you. I'm sorry. Agnes. Agnes, hurry. If we don't awaken the crystal, the whole world will get swallowed up in the darkness. We didn't come this far just to stop now, did we? There's only one to go. Awaken the Earth Crystal and it's all over. Let's go, Agnes. Together, the world is waiting for us to awaken this crystal. I know I must go, but... Right? Everyone else in? I'll go. Of course we're coming. Let's give it a quick save -a I might even go back to the village to, uh, to heal. But we're going to end today's episode off here. Guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment on this channel. And I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.